Wolan, 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 pull out DJ select every wine. And leo niko na ubaya. Na jua leo mta nichukia wa na wake njimu nichukia at the end of the day. Mimi ndonsha wapaga ukwe. Mimi ndonsha wapaga ukwe li na nenda zangu hivi ya ndo nenda za. Nenda zangu. Staki ujinga wenu kabisa. Kuna hii issue eh. Again about deadbeat dads. Deadbeat dads. I don't get why they call deadbeat dads. Dads for who? Why are they even dads? Eh? Hata paka wanazalisha. Paka si wanazalisha. Mbo wanazalisha. Jogo wanazalisha. Are they dads? They are not dads. Sasa kuna humsichana etuwa Miriam. Miriam sijua nyango. Miss Miriam. Ah, oh, my socialite. Eh, na kwambia these social media streets. Sabrina pekeke ndo mze. Sabrina pekeke ndo ana age. Otherwise. Otherwise. Kila mtu miaka yaki ni 19 to 25. He, watu hawa wiwaze kuna watu mimi nimewasikia kwenye maredio nimeona kwenye ma tv kwanza niko primary mpaka leo hii wana 35 mimi ninafika 30 mimi niko na 30 years eh ah watu kila siku 19 20 20 yani hawa grow ah malaya wabaya malaya wapende uzee nyinyi <laughs> uzee ndo raha mama wewe chezea uwe shangingi mwenzangu at least Haya back to the story. Bas mimi napenda kidogo niwape umbea kidogo. <laughs> Sasa turudi ni kwenye story. Humsichana, humsichana ana miaka 19. No comments. Awe na miaka 19, miaka 13 humsichana alipata kiboyfire. Msiwa vijua hivi vibofire va Nairobi, sijui va kuishi apartment ya Kileleshwa, sijui Westland wapi. We've all been through them. Tunawajua vizuri sana ama hatuwajui kwenzeni huko sasa sikizeni humshana akazalishwa na ukijana kijana akakataa mimba kijana paka akakupeleka DNA mimi ukishanipeleka na mtoto wangu DNA awe ni wako awe si wako you've put my kid through that shit you're never seeing that kid mother father eh mtoto wangu umempeleka through that shit awe ni wako awe si wako ndo mwanzo ndo mwisho kumuona huyo mtoto Mwanzo tena kama ndo wako ndo sasa nakufanyia kusudi eh. Fuck off. Enda katafute mtoto mwingine au na spam zingine. Spam zinkwisha. Spam zinkwisha. Wajua wanawake sometimes let's take pride. Let us take pride. Eh? Let us be women. Women sisi tuna madaraja makubwa kwenye dunia lakini we like lowering ourselves. Eh? Msichana ambiwa fungua account msichana hataki fanya hivi msichana hataki msichana mara asema alipewa 7000 ya shopping mara 8000 wenzako waitafuta 7000 dadangu wenzako waitafuta ulizeni huko nje kuna ma single mother unataka testimony za ma single mother hey, hey. unataka testimony za ma single mother una kama miaka mitatu hivi ya kukaa kusikiza tu maana kaita take miaka mitatu ma single mother tukianza testimony zetu mm? leo mkitoona na watoto hapo wenyewe wazumza kizungu sijui enda graduation enda wapi enda wapi mwafikiri ni mchezo nyinyi si mchezo si mchezo eh uwe 19 years old uwe 13 years old mama you know how to ride a dick you're a grown ass woman mtoto mdogo ni yule uko kindergarten ambaye hajui kupande ya mboro akabembea nayo hajui kukatisha kiuno akitiwa mboro akaruka ha yule ni mtoto mdogo beva jua kupanda mboro wajua kushika mimba eh bajua kufikishwa maria strop ukakataa kutoa mimba beve bajua kuingia maternity ukaza ukapiga pushu kama ukakatwa trumbu ukafanywa bajua you are a woman wewe ni mwanamke you are considered mwanamke mm Mila zetu za Kiafrika, wacheni niwakumbushe kwamba sisi ni Waafrika. Mila zetu za Kiafrika, mtoto wa kiume akifika 7 years, 10 years akishatahiriwa, he's a man. Mtoto wa kike ukishapata period zako you're a woman, you need to be able to fucking take responsibilities of your actions. Sawa? Eh, wewe mtoto mdogo ambaye hujui kwamba ulikuwa wafanya nini ukaenda kufirwa. Mm. Mimi nakwambia wache niwaambie kitu. Mimi sikumbuki manyumba za ma ex zangu hata barabara. That's how I fucking don't care about shit. But who msichana 
anajua paka nyumba this young girl mwenye pengine she's not matured enough not matured enough ajua kuwa slay queen kwenye mtandao ajua kubandika kucha ajua kupaka makeup ajua kwenda photoshoot ajua ku emotionally blackmail a man that's emotionally blackmailing a man eh msichana huyu baada ya miezi mitatu kaenda kwa mwanamume nyumbani kwake kwa mwanamume hujaitwa hukupiga simu ukaika appointment show up because you're so entitled you had a baby with this man you think men care you think men care nani aliwaambia first of all muna muko hapa as a group of women trying to force a man to be a father Considering most of us grew up in broken families. Grew up with single mothers. You should be one to talk. You need to already know that this shit's not going to happen. Hata Yesu ashuke. Mwanamume kama hataki kuwa baba, hataki kuwa baba. Mishushu atamwaga, mishushu atamwaga paka kwenye kitanda. Mishushu atamwaga jua hata ukipata mbuzi mwanamume atamwaga mishushu sio wewe ndo mimi kila siku nawaambia wasichana before you do something think about it are you ready mimi nikiamua saa hii kumzalia mwanamume am i ready if i am not ready i'm not fucking giving you a kid sawa so, i have options i can do an abortion i can do this i can do that i can do that but the minute nimeamua i'm having this child eh ama i'm gonna trap this man with a kid lazima niwe nimejipanga fulani vitu vingine siva mtu yoyote kufanya kweli hiyo trapping a man with a kid inaweza kuwa okay ukasko ukamtrap kweli a man with a kid na pia inaweza ku backfire so unaweza unafa ukwene ile plan b ki backfire sasa back to the story homes chana wa miaka 19 baada ya miezi mitatu kuzaa ati huyu bwa, mwanamume amemblocki kila mahali haizi kumbridge sijui ameambiwa tafute lawyer sijui ameambiwa tafute account opening a fucking account is a problem kufungua account shinga pi squeeze sijui 5k i think squeeze is on new rules fungua account mwache kutumia pesa kwenye account ya mtoto wewe atakakwenda upewe cash kabisa ushikushikwe mabubu eh udarwe darwe wewe ataka child support wa mtaka mwanamume lakini mimi natakia nini atakukuona sura zako uniambia nifungue account leo nafungua account weka pesa na usipoweka pesa na kuja mimi upambane na mimi mtoto hakuweko tulipokuwa tukisikia raha mimi na wewe ndio tulikuwa tukisikia raha so i'm not putting my kid through that bullshit hiyo ni ushoga huo ni ushoga first class high class Humshana akachukua mtoto saa sita za usiku. Sijui alikuwa atoka wapi saa sita za usiku. Yaani itaimi yote. Hata angekwenda pale kwa ile nyumba saa moja za usiku, pengine angempata huyo bwana hajaingia kwa nyumba wapatane hapo kwa mlango. Lakini alingoja paka saa sita na nusu usiku. Akaenda kwa nyumba ya mwanamume kwenye apartment akapanda juu, akafanya fujo mlangoni na mwanamume naye akamwambia sikufunguli. Hapa kwangu kwa babako. Why are we women so entitled? Eh? Mi uambie hizi entitlement zetu ndio zinatufanya kisha tunaenda kukuwa malaya. Why are we so entitled? Msichana hiyo sasa za usiku alipata time akampigia Uncle Edgar simu, akamtafuta Uncle Edgar kwa Instagram, akaanza kumuelezea matukio ya. Bro, you is she really trying to get child support? Is she trying to get uh, attention? Is she trying to paint this guy as a bad guy ama vipi? Ameka hapo anavosema mpaka saa 12 usubuhi. Anaijua Nairobi, anaijua kileleshwa jamanini. Anaijua apartment ya kileleshwa ndani kulivo baridi. Je, pale nde kwenye ngazi kwenye mlango kukoje? Na mtoto wa miezi mitatu alokuroga amekufa. Alo kuroga amekufa. Mwanamme kwa ni mwanamme yeye peke yake. Sisi tumezaa na watoto wetu walelewa na wanaume wengine. 
Eh akikacha yeye kuwa baba atakuja mwingine ataka kuwa baba atakuwa baba. Hataki kuwa baba akwende. Kwani ndovu yashindwa na pembe zake jamani. Uchukue mtoto wa miezi mitatu ukamkulishe baridi. Surely. Mwanzo huyo mwanaume that mwanamume mimi mali huyo mwanamume amenikasirisha mali pamoja tu. Hapo pa kutuma pesa si tume pesa hiyo ni hiari yake. Wakitaka wapelekane kotini aone atatoa pesa babake awe ni lawyer, awe ni jaji, awe ni CS, awe ni prime minister. Ampeleke kotini aone atatoa pesa ama hatoe. Lakini msichana hataki hayo ya ataka mume, hataki mtoto, ataka mume. Kumpigisha mtoto baridi paka kumnambili. Huyo mwanamume naye kama mimi huyo mwanamume. Ama mimi ningekuwa ni mwanamke niko ndani ya hiyo nyumba na huyo mwanamume. Ninge mtokea ni mtarike, ni mpokonyo yo mtoto, ninge naendani, nipigie polisi simu. E, si mashahidi wako maskari, si ni apartment. Si kuna maskari, si kuna majirani. Mimi natoka na kutandika wewe, wacha kutafuta child support. Utatefta paka medical health care yako sasa. Mana kia nita kafu kutandika. Nita kutandika. E, vewe you are not mature, you will mature that day. Nge kutandika kisha nkuite mapolisi niseme you are endangered life ya mtoto. Mtoto mchanga, saa sita usiku, nje, kilele shwa juu kwenye apartment. Si yako, si ya babako. Mpaka kuminambili. Hawa majirani pia wameoza. Na tama imu matumbo ya nikatika mimi. Matumbo ya nikatika. Yea juu kuna wanawake wangapi ya panje wanatamani wapache watoto. Anajua. Anajua ni wangapi wamezao wakapoteza watoto. Ikabidi ya bebe maiti yake ndia kazike maiti yake. Wewe mungu wamekujalia mtoto mzima wataka kumuwa na limunia. Wataka kumuwa na limunia mshenzi mkubwa kwa kuwa watefta mboro. Umeoza. Umeoza. Wache ni wambie reality. Wasichana wa Nairobi hawana makao. Wakisha pata mwanamume, waone mwanamume yuwaishi kwenye apartment nzuri. Why the fuck are you blaming a 32 year old man? Mwanamume ata ame 50 years old. Kuna wanamume wa 50 year old na they are not matured. Don't blame a man on maturity. Men never mature wana. Men never mature. Men will never ever mature. Be the woman. Muko hapa, we black women. Black empowerment to women, strong black women. I love you are coming to sympathize with this stupid girl here. Why are you sympathizing with her? Why? I don't get it. Kwa nini muna sympathize na umpumbafu? Ata mwana 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 kwe 42. Alibakwa. Se alijipeleka mwenye yu wakumbuka paka nyumba ya exu waki. Nyimu wakumbuka ma nyumba ya ma exu wengu. Mi sikumbuki kwa ma exu wangu. Sikumbuki. Yani yata nkapa pita sipajuhu. Na ini mahali likuwa nkienda pengine. Kwa sababu, why do I have to store such a stupid memory like that in my brain? My brain has other things to store. New memories, happy memories, fun memories. Not some dumbass man mwenye likata mwanamume ambaye natukana paka mtoto. Muta muisabi ya miaka, muisabu maturiti yake na miaka kweli. Mwanamume ambaye kweli hamtaki huu mwanamke but aliachapaka mtoto wacha kwamba ni mtoto wake si mtoto wake pia mwanamume yoyote mwenye akili yake mwenye imani mwenye roho angetoka amchukue yule mtoto na amfukuze huyo demu iwe ni wake iwe si wake sasa mwanamume kama huyo mnataka kumlaumu kweli huyo msichana ametoka kuzaa machungua kuzaa wewe umeza na CS bado uchungu unao mama hujapona Miezi mitatu ujapona siyesi kumamae utajitia ugonjwa lafu utajua kwa mba mwili ya unaspea. Saiwa jiono uko tough. Wenda pigisha mishono uko baridi ya Nairobi. Sasita tipaka kuminambili waona nisifa wewe. Tumeka hapa paka kuminambili. Waona tutalia. Mwanzo yo story ngepostiwa yo siku. Haki ya mungu na ajua kuna wamama kama watatu wangetokeza. Na tu hivi wakuje kwa yo apartment kukutafuta. Me being one of them. Me being one of them. Because I'm that petty. 
tukuja tukupate hapo tukutandike paka huyo bwana mwenye ukoko ndani angekuhurumia akuja kusaidia angekuja kukusaidia wacha hiyo kwamba iwakulenga angekuja kukusaidia kuna watu bwana unajua machungu yako wa mzazi you need to grow a pair right now uwe ni mdogo uwe ni nani na nyinyi wa mama wenye kuja hapa kusema oh but she's 19 years when we were 19 years we were doing mistakes too hata kama ulimfanya mistake ya kuzaa na mwanamume hakutaki did you ever really put your child at risk oh postnatal depression postnatal depression watoka saa sita kwenye nyumba waenda na mtoto kumtafuta mwanamume hata si tumezaa bwana tumezaa paka still but depression mtaniambia nini nyinyi kuhusu depression mimi depression mtaniambia nini kuhusu depression amuna kitu cha kuniambia mimi kuhusu depression depression gani hiyo postnatal depression hata ukishazaa ile kunyonyesha mtoto pia postnatal mama zenu walikuwa wakivazaa wakitoka wakenda shamba wakitoka wakenda kuoza mboga masokoni wakitoka wakenda wapi hawakuwa na postnatal depression pandeni hapa uzungu tupeni kandro mwajitia wazungu postnatal depression kuna zaidi ya postnatal depression na depression ya still bath gani mbaya? Hushukuru Mungu, Mungu amekupa mtoto wako umembeba mkononi. Ah, oh, vosne, oh, hawezi kumlaumu she still young. Still young ngoja mpate mume wa mtombeshe. Utolewe kwenye nyumba ati yeye utajua kama she still young. Uwe hapo ndo uje uniambie mimi sasa she still young but she took him a husband. Utakuja kuniambia tekesha is still young still young mtoto wa kindergarten wakifika primary yenyewe siku hizo washafundishwa kila kitu upuzi mtupu ujinga mtupu tuacheni kuendekeza upumbavu in the name of wazungu wamewaletea postnatal depression hiyo postnatal depression mmeanza kujua juzi juzi ya awareness zake zikianza are we even sure it exists kwa sababu hatukuanza sisi kuzaa Bona mama zetu walikuwa hawafanyi wazimu huo. Bakutupa watoto kwenda maklabu, kwenda mawapi, kwenda wa... kama we malaya we malaya tu. Eh? Kama we ni mshenzi we ni mshenzi, kama we ni mnyama we ni mnyama tu. Utamtupa mtoto. Utamtupa mtoto na hutoangalia nyuma. Kwa nini mpigishe mtoto baridi huo? Kisha busy yani You are saying a story utasema ni documentary tutataka kusikia it's stupid it's stupid by the way upumbavu mtupu uwezi mlazimisha mwanamume kutekea mtoto hili jambo nimesema mara ngapi mimi angalia mtoto wako leo mtoto wako siku baba atajirudisha ndio ile story ya diamond kisha museme mama ke diamond is possessive lea mtoto single mother ujua uchungu wa mtoto Uchungu sio kuzaa uchungu mkulea. Lea mtoto kisavasava, mtoto waje awe mtu kesho ndo utajua uchungu wa mtoto. Utajua mpossessive ama mpossession. Eh baba kija hata mimi natimua. Umwangalie mtoto na lolote. Wajita baba. Katika mababa na wewe pia hujihesabu baba. Mwanamke jiangalie jifikirie kabla hujafanya mambo ya kipumbavu sababu ya kutaka attention za mitandao attention za mitandao si nzuri zitatuumiza zitaumiza mpaka tuwapendao mtoto hana hatia mtoto hana hatia kabisa na kama uwezi kumlea mtoto kwa sababu baba hatoi child support nitafute nitafute mami nitafute nipe mimi wa mtoto sawa Sawa kuna wengi wataka watoto. Tafuta mtu mpe we mtoto. Basi ushike ndia yako. Sasa ufuatane na mwanamume mkisumbuana mkilaliza na ndia mlango he wala. Nothing against you. But oh, ikifika wakati you are putting a life at risk. Tutakwambia mami. Tutakwambia. Don't be stupid. Lea mtoto wako, fata mambo yako. If he's a real man atawatafuta. If he's not Mababa kibao hapa nje hushindwi kumtafutilia mtoto wako baba mwingine bwana. Ah usinisemeshe mimi. 